Ethiopia, one of Africa's new powerhouse economies. The refi plant is going to be fueled entirely by the city's waste. Welcome to the Repi Waste to Energy facility here in Addis Ababa, Ethiopia. In a very short period of time, this facility will open up to turn rubbish into much needed electricity, clean green electricity for the city of Addis Ababa. Growing up in Ethiopia, and even in my father's time, we've always known Addis to be a dirty city. Garbage is everywhere. It's outside your door, it's on all the rivers, it's in your parks, it's in your playground, it's all over your school. You lived with it, you hated it. Even after it has been collected, where it goes is even worse. We need to dispose of it in an environmentally friendly way, but we also desperately need electricity. Africa's energy problem is not just a problem, it's a major crisis. That's a massive opportunity, but that's also a massive challenge that needs to be tackled the right way. Authorities have been focusing on greener ways to get rid of waste. $120 million later and an impressive waste to energy facility is being built in the capital, Addis. This is where the magic happens. This area is where we turn the garbage into heat that will in turn produce electricity. These are modern vibrating grates that are customized custom tailored to get rid of Africa's waste. This is where the end result of all of this activity, electricity, will be made available to those who need it. Stretching right behind me down that valley will be a line of pylons carrying the electricity produced here and feeding it into the Ethiopian national grid, making vast quantities of power available for the whole nation. We are at the moment at the Repi Waste to Energy project. It's our first waste to energy project in Africa, but it's also the first waste to energy project to be realized in Africa. We have been contracted by Ethiopian Electrical Power. Our job includes quality control and trying to teach the owner how the plant should be operated in the future by local people. For us at Cambridge, it's really addressing two things. One, we have to duplicate this for other African cities. And two, we have to create knowledge transfer so that African engineers could be able to maintain this could be able to duplicate this later on. This type of facilities are in various European cities. You can find it in London, Paris, Copenhagen, Stockholm, Oslo. They're already turning their garbage into electricity. Why not African cities? Why can't we have this in the middle of Kampala, in the middle of Nairobi, in the middle of Lagos, in the middle of Gabroni? We could do this, we could turn Africa's waste into a treasure. 